Hi, I'm Mama. And darn. Hey guys, welcome back to Allie Can Cook featuring Mama McManus. Hi, I'm Mama McManus. And I'm Allie, and on today's episode of Allie Can Cook, we are showing you guys how we now make we our make. favorite mushroom, onion, and leek casserole. And this is so nice comfort food. Yes, it is. It's not necessarily the healthiest, I would say. There is oil and there is bread. Yes. However, it's a cozy dish that will warm you up on these cold February nights. You'll enjoy it. And your guests will enjoy it too if you serve. And it's pretty easy to make. So if you guys want to see how we make our mushroom onion leek casserole, keep watching. So what we've done for prep work here is I've cut up about three cups of mushrooms. I've just sliced them. And then we also have one small white onion chopped up and one leek chopped up. But we only chopped the bottom, so see here, this is garbage. We're not gonna actually use this part. Bye. The first step that you want to do for this dish is cut up some baguette. You wanna cut it decently thin, so about a quarter of the piece of bread. And then line a casserole dish with the bread on the bottom. And this is gonna act kind of as like our base to the casserole mm -hmm. to give it a little bit more fullness. We're going to drizzle some olive oil over this. Sprinkle it with some salt, pepper, and fresh thyme. We have some from our garden here, but uh, you can also just get some at the store. Now we are going to take this and put it in the oven for 10 minutes at 350. And while it's baking, we're gonna to start to prep the rest of our vegetables. We forgot to say that we're also adding spinach in at the beginning. So make sure you have some spinach available too. So I'm going to use a deep dish pan. I'm going to heat up some olive oil, medium low temperature, and then I'm going to add the leeks and onions and saute them until they're caramelized. The onions are coming along very nicely. I'm going to now add in the mushrooms. I'm going to cook them for another five minutes. So in total, this will be about 10 to 15 minutes that we've cooked everything. Okay, so 10 minutes has passed and our bread is now baked. So I'm just going to take it out of the oven and set it off to the side here while we cook up the rest of our vegetables. And now I'm going to add in a half a cup of vegetable broth and a tablespoon of lemon juice. Next, you wanna add in a full can of coconut cream. You're gonna to wanna to add in salt, pepper, and some thyme. So we're gonna simmer this for about 10 minutes to thicken it up a bit. It's been 10 minutes and the sauce is now all thickened up. Our spinach is wilted, so now it's time for us to pour this mixture over our toasted baguettes. I'm going to take some breadcrumbs and sprinkle them on top of the casserole dish. Your oven should still be preheated to 350 degrees. We're going to add in our casserole dish now and bake it for about 10 to 15 minutes. So just keep an eye on it because you don't want it to get burnt. A few moments later. Alrighty guys, so that is how you make our mushroom onion leek casserole. It's super simple to make, very few ingredients, but it's warm and cozy and, and it just smells great. Yeah, it smells amazing right now. Really, really, really good. One of the things that you can do with this too is serve it with a really nice big fresh salad. Yeah. Lots of greens and tomatoes and things like that and it would complement it really well. Yeah. Make definitely. a really full dinner. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, it's about 10.30 in the morning, so. so... We really don't want to dig into it. Yeah, we're not going to have casserole just yet, but definitely try it out and, and let us know what you guys think. As always, thank you so much for watching today's video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe. We make new videos every single Thursday and we'll see you guys next week. Bye guys. Bye guys.